What the hell are dreams, anyway? Mysteries. Incredible body hocus pocus. The truth is, we still don't know what they are or where they come from. Why, hello! What's up? It's Mighty Iris. Welcome to my Dream Warrior podcast. It's been a while. I use the word podcast as if it's popular. It's not. I just, I, I meant to record my dreams and it's just been so long since I've had a chance to do this, but the dreams have been flowing. They've just been flowing into me like I'm on acid. They're just coming and coming and coming. It's insane. Every night I've had a dream, but it was the weekend. So anyway, today's Monday and I had one last night. It was terrible, man. Okay, so it's like I'm watching a video of myself. Someone recorded a video of me on their phone. I'm at a party and I'm drunk. I'm hammered drunk and I'm watching it and I'm like, oh my God, I don't remember this. This is terrible. I blacked out. Someone recorded me. I'm at this bar. There's a DJ booth next to me, but I'm not behind the DJ booth. I'm like kind of dancing on the dance floor, kind of just like swaying back and forth. And I'm watching this video. Okay. So it's in the point of view of the camera, like someone's camera phone. And I'm dancing and all of a sudden my boobs are out. Like I'm, I'm wearing like this button up something, but the it's it's open and I have a spaghetti strap or something on, but the, the blouse is down around my waist, I think, and my boobs are just out. They're out. So my tits are out and I'm leaning over to someone and I know who this someone is, but I don't know that I should name drop them. Uh, it's a it's a guy, a friend of mine. And yeah, I just don't want to throw his name under the bus because it's just so weird that he happened to be standing right next to me, not knowing that I'm exposed. Meanwhile, someone behind him is whispering to him like, dude, her tits are out. Look, you know, and he sees it. I'm, I'm just embarrassed and I hate the way my breasts look all exposed on this video that I'm watching. It's embarrassing. I'm going to say the word embarrassing a lot during this podcast episode just be prepared for that so anyway I'm just making conversation as I'm like dancing and the camera is getting closer and closer to me and then someone like kind of tells me like hey like look down you know and I'm like oh my god and I cannot find how my shirt is supposed to button up and the camera's getting closer and closer the lights getting brighter and brighter on my face and I'm looking up at the camera and my lip starts quivering like I'm gonna start crying and it's Raul that's filming me and I'm starting to hit him like my arms are flying at him like how could you record me like why are you doing this to me kind of thing my my eyes were tearing up I looked like a sad puppy like humiliated I'm humiliated I feel betrayed and I wake up with tears running down my face because I woke up knowing that I'm pounding on his arm like I'm hitting him you know and so I woke up and I was like oh my god I had the worst dream of about you like I was hitting you because you recorded me in this vulnerable state like I'm drunk I'm blackout drunk and my tits are out and you're filming it and I think the thought was that everyone had seen this video and I don't know it was just I woke up humiliated and embarrassed so anyway I haven't had a chance to look up what this means in a dream so I'm gonna google that right now okay so this one thing says anything exposed in a dream shows the need to confront what may be hidden away If you feel exposed, the dream can be examining your ideas about intimacy. Perhaps you revealed yourself emotionally in a way that left you feeling uncomfortable. Yeah. Okay. So that makes sense because last week I was on my period. I was having my women times. So I'm feeling depressed all last week. I was feeling like sad and I let something that I was thinking of out. I I expressed something that I now regret expressing and I feel humiliated kind of or embarrassed that I said that so that could be why (laughs) I don't know Uh, here's another thing Ooh, how specific your breast exposed in public yeah I dreamt that okay exposing your breast in public is a bad omen in dreams Uh uh-oh this could be an indication that you are slowly losing control of your life, especially private and personal matters. This may be exacerbated by someone who is trying to ruin your reputation by exposing your dirty laundry to the public. Yikes, I'm not on Vanderpump Rules. This individual could be part of your closest friends or loved ones, which gives them access to your personal life. As such, your mind may be telling you to choose your friends carefully or risk betrayal. 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 The taste of betrayal. Ooh la la. That's insane, man. Dang. Okay. Well, definitely the PMS thing. When I was sad, I definitely said something I wish I did not say. So 
Maybe that's what it is. But either way, this was just the worst dream. It was just like, oh my God. And I have a tendency to record things when I'm drinking. The next night I'll wake up, especially if I blacked out, and I'll look through my files, my photos, my videos. And when there's a video, I'm like, oh no, oh no, I lost track of time. This is what might have happened during that time. And it's just embarrassing to hear my drunk voice and to see how I act and how I talk. And it's all embarrassing. So this was definitely a crazy dream. I felt it like eh, it's just always that feeling of, damn, I fucked up like in a dream. I was fucked up and I fucked up, you know, it's never good, but definitely felt betrayed by Mr. Raul. in that dream i told him about it and he's like oh i'm so sorry he's like i'd never do that to you and i was like i know you wouldn't so why am i dreaming that anyway so that was my little quick podcast about a dream that i had on sunday night waking up monday morning today's monday but i had some over the weekend that i feel like i can't talk about it sucks when i have a dream that i don't feel like i can talk about i don't know we'll get into that later anyway thank you for listening to the dream warriors podcast This is Mighty Iris signing off saying don't eat late because you might dream fucked up shit, shit, shit.